Now, in a follow-up to last week's news, David said, is it OK we want Josh Whittacombe for PM as long as he gives us HS3 and a fast train to the southwest? <laughs> After suggesting a high-speed rail link to Devon last week, Josh made it uh, onto the website of Devon Live. <laughs> <laughs> I genuinely... I yeah. made a joke about... It's HS4, because HS3 is a different branch of Good point. the yes. northern one. Yep. Um, <laughs> I made a joke about... Yeah. HS4 going to Devon, I thought it'd be funny. Yep. And then the papers got onto it and they've got behind it. I think it's a good idea. I'm, I'm back in it. Really? You're all on board? start a revolution. This yep. is it. I genuinely believe this could be my defining achievement as a human being. I agree. And we look. <laughs> I mean, he's a right little Che Guevara, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> we did have a look on Devon Live for a list of the most famous Devonians. Josh came in at number 30. Uh, behind Chris Martin from Coldplay, Sir Francis Drake, Miranda Hart and J.K. Rowling, who was there because she studied in Exeter. Uh, <laughs> it gave us an idea, though, because this could... You're right, this could be Josh's legacy. There might one day be a movie about him, and we've got just the person to play the lead role. <laughs> uh, Jesse, we've, we've got scripts over here for everyone. We've written a script. Imogen, there's a part for you, too. You, you will be the mayor of the South West. Excellent. Mm -hmm. uh, John, there's one for you. We need you to go off and prepare really quickly. Screaming baby. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So, could everyone come over here? <coughs> uh, OK, we need scripts. There's one for you, Imogen. Thank um, you. Do you mind if I just put this on you as, okay, the, uh, as the mayor? That's great. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Lovely. Yes, Thank you. Go. I'll be down here. Um, all right. And, uh, and, uh... And scene. Action. So, we are agreed. It's cream, then jam. <laughs> and that concludes the Devon and Cornwall Town planning meeting for another fortnight. Not so fast. <laughs> <laughs> With a comb. Permission to hold the... Is it pasty? It's pasty, Permission yeah. to hold the pasty. Agreed. Oh, yeah. That's what you hold when you speak. Permission to continue <laughs> holding my script as well. <laughs> <laughs> Members of the local council, I, Josh Whittacombe, have a dream. I see a future. A train with a buffet car rather than a trolley. <laughs> a train where we don't have to put our hands outside the doors to open them. <laughs> Platforms that are at least as long as the train. <laughs> and to that end, I want to put Top Sham <laughs> <laughs> on the map. And not just Top Sham. Top Sham. <laughs> not just Top Sham. Top Sham. <laughs> but, but also Bodeman. <laughs> And liskiered. <laughs> and not just those things, but also Chudley Knighton. <laughs> I see a world where people can travel from London to Cornwall just a tiny bit quicker. <laughs> You're a fool, Widdicombe. It'll never happen. Well, you, you got my surname wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, you're number 30. Well... <laughs> Well you, might, well, you might not listen to me, but you might listen to Sir Francis Drake. <gasps> <laughs> yes. Josh is right. <laughs> I may only be the third most famous Devonian, <laughs> but I know a good idea when I see one. <laughs> All in favour, say R. Motion approved! Hello, this is Josh Whittacombe. Uh, thank you for watching whatever it is you've just watched. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel because I've heard it's an important thing that I'm meant to tell you to do. You'll get clips, updates, and whatever my agent tells me to do for the good of my career, which could only be beneficial for you.